uh, Sykes Reef in the Bunker Group off uh, Queensland. We've left Gladstone uh, last night, in the middle of the night, and we've uh, motored all night, and it's been a pretty horrendous ride. We had up to 40 knots of wind during the night. When you're trying to sleep during that, it's not the most comfortable thing. There's two boats. We're on the two rower, and uh, there's another boat off here beside us, owned by the same guy. We're here for the Inter-Pacific Spearfishing Championships. It's between New Zealand, Australia, Tahiti, New Caledonia, Guam and Hawaii. So half of us are on this boat, half of us are on the other boat that's anchored over beside us here. So it's our first day, we're going to have a look around the edge of the reef. You can, you can see behind me here we've got a reef system. This is Sykes Reef. We're going to go and have a look at all this and just have a, a general look around for the day. Um, the competition starts in a couple of days, so we get a chance to just scout the area and check it all out. So, uh, this is the Bunker Group, Queensland, Australia.
competitions all over, the Indo-Pacific champs. It was a really good result for New Zealand. We, uh, in the men's, we just about won it, which would have been the first time ever under tropical conditions that the New Zealand team's ever beaten like either the local team or a team that should win in the tropics. So New Caledonia and Tahiti were the favourites to win because it was a tropical area, followed closely by Australia because we are off their coast. But um, New Caledonia pipped us, we had the same amount of fish as them, but they had a little bit more weight. And our girls won the second day, unfortunately the first day they didn't do as well as they would have liked, but they did win day two, but the Aussies took it out overall in the females. So we're just about back into Gladstone, we're going through a minefield of ships, it's quite a big port Gladstone where we left from, so we'll be disembarking off this boat tonight. So great trip, great place to Coral Sea, I'm really keen to come back and see some more of it.